Hi guys, how you doing? This is a new tutorial about some new features inside the Magic Touch panel for Photoshop. We will be looking at the look section, which is one of the biggest sections inside the Magic Touch panel. And uh, I'd like to show you the themed looks. As you can see, we have really a, quite a lot of looks. And especially in the last release, we added some new cool looks, which is Blade Runner Blue, Blade Runner Orange, Illustrative Look and Cyberpunk, which is one of the first looks we added to the panel, but which I'd like to show you anyway. So in order to use all of these looks, you basically have just to open a photo and click on the look so like this cyberpunk click on it and photoshop will do the rest as you can see you have this incredibly awesome i would say it's a really awesome look uh, photoshop or better to say the panel will create a cyberpunk folder with the applied look and with the original image if you want to avoid to create both of the layers so create just the applied look layer. You can go to settings, then go to panel options and uncheck the group with original. So let me go back to the look section. Let me delete the cyberpunk folder and click again on cyberpunk. As you can see, now you have just the cyberpunk layer. So very easy, very simple, but still an amazing effect. We worked really hard, guys, to achieve all these incredibly stylish looks. So let's try something else. Go, for example, for the space one, which we used to create the Blade Runner Orange. As you can see, when you go with the mouse over the name of the look, an overview on top of the panel will pop up so you can see what's that look about so let's press blade runner orange and now we have that awesome stylish blade runner orange movie look applied directly to your image in no time Let's do that with this one, which is a little bit more complicated, but still really awesome. So in order to apply the Blade Runner blue effect to this image, you should first protect the skin tones. So you can just select them uh, as, as you wish. And once you do this, you can just save your selection. So I call it skin. So I have it saved in my channels right here. So I can deselect. And now I can just go to the Blade Runner Blue and apply the effect. So as you can see, now we have this super cool, awesome Blade Runner look, but we have to reveal again the skin tones, right? So we can just go to Select, Load Selection and call the Skin Channel. Now we have the Skin Channel selected, so now we can just go to the Smart Filter here and just paint over it with the black color in order to reveal the skin tones like this. Okay, so this could be it. But as you can see, maybe it's a little bit too, too much, right? So maybe let's do it with not a 100% opacity, let's do it with something like 40% opacity. So reveal it slowly like this. Maybe let's give it another 30%, something like this. Okay, not 3, 30. Should work to make it look better and still realistic. Okay, so something like this would be quite cool. So as you can see with the smart filter applied to this Blade Runner effect, you, you can also, of course, decide which part of the skin you can protect or not. As I said before, you can select the skin in many, many ways. You can paint, paint over them, you can select them with the select uh, protect skin tones and basically as you wish. Now let's see another example of the illustrative look. This one is also very, very cool. Just click on illustrative look. Magic touch panel will do its magic. 
and here you have your illustrative look as you can see before and after <laughs> it's really really cool hey yeah you can use it whenever you like some advertisings or some something different you can just play with it as you wish of course if the look is too strong you can just lower down the opacity a bit and do something in between the photographic look and the illustrative look so it's this style it's it's often used in advertising so creative advertising styles so you can use it very very easily and of course like this you can use the teal and orange too teal and orange classic epic land summer vibes miami warm and all the other great looks we have inside the magic touch panel okay guys so i hope you this tutorial helped you out to, in order to use better all the amazing features of the magic touch panel as the retouch section look section face warp effects utilities and finish see you next time and enjoy your creativity and photo editing again